So I just finished watching the Crew 2's trailer, and to be honest, I don't entirely know how I feel about what they've done. Yes, they are still remaining in the United States, which at this point, I'm not upset about. I was first a little like, oh, uh, really? In the beginning, but then when I actually saw some gameplay and I saw... You know how beautiful the game now looks and by the looks of things they kind of like did some updates I'm I'm okay with it it took a long time for them to make the map so they kind of want to use it to the best of their abilities what I am a little disappointed in though is the fact that they pretty much went away from what the crew originally was and they actually expanded more on an expansion so Pretty much what it looks like the crew 2 is going to be is a full version of what the crew's expansion wild run if i believe that's what it was called the first expansion they're pretty much doing a bigger version of the wild run where you're also playing a new character and you're just going through different motorsports trying to work your way up and i guess be the best that you can be they've also added in Boat racing and plane racing, which I really don't care for. But when I saw a bit of the boat gameplay, I was like, eh, I can at least deal with that. But the planes, I don't know. I, I really don't care for the planes whatsoever. It's just like GTA 5. I don't care about planes. Boats, I can be a little iffy on. But planes, hell no. The rest of the stuff, like the cars, the off-roading that i'm obviously down with everything else meh i also don't like the fact that by the looks of things it kind of goes away from what the crew stood for by the looks of things you're just playing as a solo guy just trying to work your way up and it looks like you're doing it by yourself so what's the point in calling it the crew if it's a solo thing this also worries me on the route the story is going to be taking because we kind of already know what's happening in the trailer. You're pretty much just going to work your way up to the top in various motorsport races. I can't see there being an amazing story because that's one of the reasons why I enjoyed The Crew 1 was because it actually had a pretty good story. It was a story that I was actually really engaged in. I really liked the characters that kept on getting involved in The Crew 2. I can't see there being anything close to as good as the crew one. So story wise and everything, this game really does have me worried. I think the gameplay will definitely try to make up for it. Well, to an extent, I can't see it being like, oh, I'm going to completely ignore the fact that the story is nowhere near as good because of gameplay wise, but you... I hope you get what I'm saying. This was pretty much my first impressions. Do I like what's happening with the crew too? Yes and no. Gameplay wise, I think this is going to be a lot better since I'm pretty sure they're going to be doing a lot more improvement. The game looks beautiful, but when it comes to almost everything else, I'm very worried. I think that's pretty much my theme now with Need for Speed Payback. I was a little worried on how the gameplay was. And in this case, for The Crew 2, I'm a little worried on how the story and everything's going to be. And I really don't care for the boats and the planes. So, I wish Alex returned and the 510 crew. I don't know if maybe the main character we're going to be playing in this one might have a connection with the 510. Maybe... He came from the 510 and is trying to go professional. Maybe similar to how Need for Speed Pro Street was. I guess that could be a decent comparison because Ryan Cooper, who was the main character there, was a street racer, now going amateur pro-ish, if that made sense. Maybe that's what this is kind of going to be similar to. I don't know. We're going to have to find out more later on in the future. But until next time, this has been your boy Taking Heat. Let me know what you guys think about the crew too. Do you like it? Do you hate it? Let's have a discussion. Peace out.
Make, 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 make the ground shake.